So if there is any encouragement in Christ, any comfort from love, any participation in the Spirit, any affection and sympathy, complete my joy by being of the same mind, having the same love, being in full accord and of one mind. Do nothing from selfish ambition or conceit, but in humility count others more significant than yourselves. Thomas and Devin, what a great day this is. It is an honor to stand here with you in the presence of your family and your groomsmen and your bridesmaids and all of the dear friends who have joined with you to celebrate on this occasion. And we want you to know on this day, we are with you, we are excited for you, and we want to be God's witnesses on this day as you enter into this covenant of marriage together. Thomas and Devin, what sign do you bring for this marriage? A ring. Well, these rings are the outward and visible sign of an inward and spiritual grace, signifying to us the union between Jesus Christ and the church. So Thomas, as you place the ring on Devin's finger, would you repeat after me? Devin, I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and faithfulness. Those whom God has joined together, let no one separate. Thomas, you may kiss your bride. as my older sister. You are incredibly loyal and thoughtful and you are a constant example of what it means to selflessly love others. I know you guys have loved each other for a long time, but you guys have loved the Lord even longer, which is awesome. Therefore, I urge you to lead a life worthy of your calling, for you have been called by God. Always be humble and gentle. Be patient with each other, making allowance for each other's faults because of your love. Make every effort to keep yourselves united in the spirit, binding yourselves together in peace. I've had the privilege of being Thomas's older brother for the past 23 God here, whether as an athlete, as a person, or as a brother, you have always made me incredibly proud. My prayer for both of you is that you will continue to put in the work in your relationship with your Heavenly Father and with each other. 